I can't begin to tell you how many exciting things are happening and what I'm excited about. First of all, we listed that we were gonna possibly sell our bus or tear apart ours and reconvert it. Well, we have decided that we're gonna take our 40 foot bus, not this one, this is the nanny bus, but we are going to convert our bus again. So we're ripping apart today our whole entire bedroom. Back there is where all the bunk beds are gonna go for the kids and their whole entire play area. We're redoing that, we're redoing the bathroom and the shower, we're redoing our bedroom, we're also gonna be redoing the kitchen and the living room, everything. We're redoing everything on the inside. I got all of our wood. <sighs> so excited. Also, we got two cats. All right, this is it. So this is the bedroom. I already started taking out the where we keep our clothes up here. What, what is that called? I don't even know. Um, but all this, everything you see is going to be completely empty. And uh, I got Emily's approval. My reluctant permission is maybe what I would call it. <laughs> but this video goes out to Rec Pro. We're, we're getting all of our stuff from them. I'm excited. I think it's going to be really great quality stuff. And it's, I mean, it's where everybody gets their stuff for RVs. When we were getting the first nanny bus, that bus didn't work out. Jessica from the Painted Buffalo has that bus now. And we still don't know what's going on with that one yet. Uh, if you're interested in buying it, reach out and let us know. Anyway, when we were working on that first nanny bus though, I almost died trying to get everything out of there, starting the demolition process. But I had the wonderful Amy to help me. And now Amy has committed herself to help me with this project as well. Are you ready? Yep, ready. Well, the garage is now built in. So when you open up the back door, you have a garage. We also finished out the bedroom. So this is day four working on the, just the bedroom part where we ripped out our bedroom, put in the bunk beds in the back. So this is what we've got so far. Leaving the buses behind, we're gonna go. I got Mike here with me. Yo, yo. And uh, we're gonna go pick up the shower and the stove and, well, whatever we can fit in the back of this. We are taking a break from converting to fly to South Dakota to play at Augustana University. And we left the kids with Nanny Amy for three days. We're just waking up in our hotel here in South Dakota. We're gonna go get some breakfast and then we're gonna walk around and explore town and we're gonna go get lunch. Coffee? lunch and coffee, and then I'm gonna go do some emails and stuff at the coffee shop while Emily probably goes to a thrift store because that's what she does. How did you do? And then we were playing at Augustana University I today. Said, uh, Augustana. You said it different every time that you said it on the camera. Look, you'll see when you do the vlog last time, you said Augustana. <laughs> I don't know, it's one of those. Know, I don't know how to say it. Wait, no. Augustana. Anyway, so we're playing there today and it's gonna be a glorious day. Okay, we just got to the 
restaurant that we're hanging out with with, the, with our new friends. Oh, okay. And the water. Yep, 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 yep. So we're gonna go play at their college today and it's gonna be a glorious, glorious day. It's gonna be fun. And then back to school -y renovations. <laughs> we have made it to the school. We got lights that make us look like we're famous. We got people that book us and carry our stuff that makes us also look like we're famous, but we're not. Yet. 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 And they are called Arbor Season, so give them a nice round of applause, everyone. Yes. Again, yes. So we're just like, you know, doing nothing and hanging out with the coolest people on the planet. All right, so the question has been, what the heck are we gonna do about our bus? Are we gonna buy a new one? Are we just gonna convert ours? And we have decided, what are you doing that for? These are oh, are, are those the, are are we the scales? We have decided that we're just gonna convert our bus. Um, like we're gonna reconvert it. Reconvert it. So the, the couple of reasons for that is, I don't wanna make a roof deck again. I don't wanna have to put a you know, whole new solar system in, though that was really fun. Um, and like the outside of our bus to me is just like, it's exactly what I would do again. And all the components and everything like that is exactly what I would do again. So I thought it would be a lot cheaper and quicker to just reconvert our bus. And I'm finding that to be true because in just five days we were able to convert like a whole room and we're already moving on to others. And I already got a new hundred gallon water tank. You know what I mean? It's just things that I thought would take longer are, are actually happening very fast. So, so we're taking something that we already love and we're making it way better. And this way in the future, if we do want to sell it, we'll also feel better about it because it'll be built so much better than it was the first time. Yep. So no buying a new bus. We're just going to convert ours. So if you were planning on buying it, we're sorry, but we're not going to sell it. So, yeah. But thank you guys so much for being with us this week. We hope to, we hope you follow along on our journeys and uh, subscribe and like and share if you like our adventures. And we're just so excited to get back on a plane back to our kids, even though we missed our flight this morning and had to book a new one because we thought our flight was at nine o'clock, but it was actually at six. So okay, we got some extra sleep. Yep. Well, thanks for being here, everybody. Until next time.